This is James Fox with another video tutorial for QuickBooks Pro 2013. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you where some of the icons and menus are located that will be used to write and print checks. Now the first icon that I'm going to point out to you is the Write Checks icon located here on the QuickBooks homepage. Now this icon is self-explanatory. When you click the icon, it opens up the Write Checks window. And here is where we're going to write our checks. Alternatively, you can click on the banking menu and simply click Write Checks or you can use the keyboard shortcut which is Control W. Now going back to the QuickBooks home page, the next icon that we're going to focus on is the Check Register icon. Now let's click on the icon so you can see what the check register looks like. Now the check register keeps track of all of the checks that were written from your company's bank account and all of the checks that were deposited into your company's bank account. For example, on August the 1st, a deposit was made into Joe's Landscaping's bank account of $5,000 and on August the 2nd, a check was written to Dewey Company in the amount of $10 for travel expenses. So the check register will keep track of all of the transactions that were made to and from your company's bank account. Now the next icon that we're going to review is the print checks icon. Now whenever you use the write checks feature, you have the option of choosing whether or not if you want those checks to be printed later. And when you are ready to print those checks, you're going to click the print checks icon. When you click the print checks icon, you'll see the select checks to print dialog box and you will choose which checks you want to be printed by placing a check mark in the far left column next to the check that you want to be printed. Now the next icon on the list is the reconcile icon. This icon will be used when you're ready to reconcile your company's bank statement. You can click on the reconcile icon here or you can click on the banking menu then click reconcile. An entire chapter on this website will be dedicated in showing you how to reconcile a bank statement. The next two icons that I'm going to show you kind of work hand in hand. They are the Enter Bills icon and the Pay Bills icon. When you receive an invoice from one of your vendors, you're going to enter the bill here. And here is the Enter Bill screen. And when you're ready to pay that bill, you're going to click the Pay Bills icon and those bills will be listed here. Alternatively, you can access these features by clicking on the Vendors menu and then clicking on either Enter Bills or Pay Bills. Now the last thing I want to show you is the Order Checks menu. Obviously, if you're printing checks, you're going to need to reorder checks at a certain point. If you want to reorder checks from Intuit, you can click the Banking menu navigate to Order Checks and Envelopes and then click Order Checks. And here is where you can get started in ordering checks if you want to order checks directly from Intuit. And those are the icons and menus that we will be using most frequently. If you have any questions, please send me an email. Once again, my name is James Fox and I'll see you next time.